Hey, and welcome to the workshop. So this is going to be a little different. We're going to actually do a remodel in our house, taking uh, two different bedrooms that are side by side and taking the wall down. So in this video, I'm going to cover the demolition of that wall. And then we're going to do this in more of a vlog style and also cover each little phase of the project. So let's go ahead and get started. So I've done some exploratory um, busting into these holes, into the walls, because I needed to figure out where um, the electrical was because we had an outlet on one side of the wall and outlet on the other side, an outlet, it's just several places. So finally figured out where the wiring goes. There's a pipe in the way too. So we've got a wire that starts up here in this corner and it goes all the way down, straight across. Then there's outlet on either side of the wall there. Um, there actually is another outlet. Um, you can't really see it right now, but, but it's right there where the wire turns. I think we're gonna have to reroute that up in the um, up in the ceiling. The joist go this way, so I'll be able to just put it in a cavity, go right across, back down the outside wall, and put another junction box. But the beauty is we're actually gonna put an outlet right there um, that'll face out just like that one. So I'll be able to use that as the junction box as well. Started also to rip out the closet here, getting that started. Um, this is actually just day one of the demo it's a friday i've got some help coming tomorrow we're really gonna be into this thing and hopefully get this wall down so that's the plan right now i am getting ready to beat back at this wall get a little more exploring done uh, so i can figure out exactly what i'm going to do with this electrical stuff and then it will be big old demo time tomorrow So my help's not here yet, so I'm going to try to get some of this debris out of the house, throw it out there. Uh, of course, it's raining today, so that just makes things really interesting. I'm going to have to be careful where I put all of this wall debris, since water and this doesn't mix well. I'm trying to put it in some big cardboard boxes it got. But this wood, I'm just going to go haul it out, get it in my trailer, and then uh, keep on chugging away at this thing. Made a mistake, I did not wear gloves yesterday. My hands paid price. Okay, so well, uh, I got all that wood out. Now I got to start scooping this stuff up. I'm just going to use a snow shovel, put it in a, um, a little box, and just try to get stuff. Uh, this little piece is actually a piece I wanted to save because I had made this out of a piece of pine. It's actually something you might have seen in one of my videos um, making some baseboard trim. So I'm going to save that because it's a really good piece of craft pine because this wall that I took it off, which it was right down here, um, we're not putting that on there. Um, we're going to put B board over this wall and then some shoe molding. So I don't need that big thick trim. Uh, but some of these two befores I'm trying to save so I can use for some framing uh, over here where the uh, old closet was. Okay, well, room is cleared up a lot more, got all the garbage out, but you know, I'm going to end up with a ton. And that box that I filled up ended up being extremely heavy, so I'm going to have to be mindful how much I fill in there. But this whole entire wall is coming down pretty much uh, kind of right where the door ends. Uh, so it's this times two because you got to remember the other side's got the same stuff. Um, like I said yesterday, I have this wire I pretty well figured out. You know, I'm just going to have to reroute it up, up and above and down. But uh, I don't think it'll be too big of a problem. And then over here, for the closet, um, I'm going to mark here. These are going to be where the actual wall will be coming across here. So that'll be the closet on this side. And then that'll be the separation. So it does jet out 
maybe like four more inches so I'm not worried about taking that stuff off the back of the wall there I think at this point I'm just gonna go ahead and start cleaning up a little bit more but start busting down some of this wall put up some plastic on the other side because that is our right now bedroom and we are still gonna need that so I have to seal it up really really well so that we don't have any dust and debris getting over there. The other side of the wall is this, and this is coming down, and here is the adjacent hole to it. This is the hole that we had from the other side. So I ended up taping it up really, really good. This is like super duper sealed up, I think. <laughs> Plastic, and uh, of course the bedroom's on the other side, so that is um, hopefully gonna be dust free. So my help's about here. I'm gonna be uh, just kind of prepping. I still got some trim to take off on this side down to baseboard. Um, so gonna get kind of situated with my help and gotta get my children a lunch. Um, so we'll get that squared away. All right, so my help has arrived. This is my father-in-law and he is here to help me out tearing down this massive wall. And uh, this is gonna be quite fun. So let's get at it. Well, the wall's gone, or mostly. I thought the wall has been beaten. What, what, what are we calling the tool? Chris, this is Newt. Newt. It's a heavy duty crowbar that I inherited from my dad. And he claimed that there wasn't anything that this tool couldn't move. So I brought Newt today so dad would have part of this demo. And cool. so far, he was right. Oh, yeah. We use that primarily on this whole wall because mine is a little smaller and just didn't do it. But that definitely took care of it. No problem at all. So, our point now is just clearing it up, clearing the mess, and kind of assess what we're going to do on our next step. Okay, well, the wall's down. We cleaned it up. Gonna have some flooring that's gotta be fixed up. Some wiring that's gotta be buttoned up. But wow, what such a difference. So now the two rooms are one. And this right here would have been a view I could have never had. So we're gonna be really happy. Now that I've got the wall down, I am actually getting really excited for this project. All right, so that's pretty much it for the demo. We've got a little bit of cleaning up that's gotta be done and then uh, start thinking about finishing it off and getting it all back together but that'll be the next video so i sure hope you enjoyed this one and if you did please give me a thumbs up and if you haven't already please consider subscribing to the channel and uh we'll be back here for part two of getting everything squared away so thank you for watching i'll see you next time